For the first time, the average price for a gallon of gas has officially surpassed $4 in all 50 states. Our Washington correspondent, Rashad Hudson, has reaction now from lawmakers in our top story at 5. Republicans are slamming the Biden administration for causing sky-high gas prices. President Biden's energy policy is wind, solar, and wishful thinking. Louisiana Senator John Kennedy and West Virginia Senator Shelley Moore Capito say decisions like canceling recent oil leases will make it harder for commuters in their states. We are rural America where cars are the only way to get to the places that you need to be. Capito says she's getting letters describing the tough decisions facing Americans. I fear before summer I will literally be choosing which to pay, fuel for my vehicle or food. The White House blames Russia's invasion of Ukraine for the record high gas prices, but Republicans argue they aren't doing enough to bring down cost. Let's unleash American energy. Instead of blaming the president, Wisconsin Senator Tammy Baldwin says Republicans should help pass her bill preventing price gouging. You would see a different behavior from the big oil companies. They wouldn't be able to get away with what they're getting away with these days. AAA says this week gas prices hit a new high, with every state paying more than $4 a gallon. Reporting in Washington, Rashad Hudson.